Hey, how you doing? My name is Blake. I hope you're having a good day. I am doing great. If you've watched my videos, you know that my channel is about helping people make money. And I've been thinking about this, thinking about my mission statement, what I'm trying to do, and I realized that probably my scope has been too narrow. I've niched down over and over again until I only make content about two or three things. And while that works for me, that is not good for people at large, the viewers. And so this video, I want to talk about uh, a skill set that I know a lot of you have and how you can use it to make over $100,000 easily working from home. If you like to read and write, if you like to solve puzzles, I think this video is going to be for you. We're going to go over jobs that use those skills uh, to bring in customers to sell products uh, and why that's okay. If you don't want to run your own business, that's fine. Uh, it's very stressful. Running your own business requires a lot of capital usually. And sometimes for most people, uh, having a job like this, a remote job, gives them more money overall, more freedom overall, and just a better quality of life. What I want to talk about is remote copywriting. Remote copywriting. What this is, is if you go to any website and there's words on the website and those words were there, you know, on purpose, not just random gobbledygook, that is copywriting. And copywriting has two main objectives, at least how I've done it. One is to either get people from search engines to your website or on the website, get people to convert either an email sign up or buying something, uh, get them to do whatever you want them to do. Uh, perform that call of action you're going to have on the page. I do all my own copywriting. I've done uh, contract copywriting. I've done copywriting just as a job when I was younger. Uh, what you're doing is researching and writing what you are researching on in a uh, concise manner, in a way that speaks both to search engines and people. It's a good mix of using your creative muscles to figure out how something sounds good and your analytical muscles to figure out what needs to be said. A lot of these jobs do not require advanced degrees or years and years of experience. Certainly if you have those, you'll make more money, uh, but they're really geared towards entry level positions because what you're doing does not rely on years of knowledge and expertise. It relies more on your ability to process information. I'm not being paid to talk about this. I just think if you're someone out there who's hurting for money and you've tried retail arbitrage and you've tried eBay, you've tried everything else under the sun that I've talked about, uh, maybe try this. I am not looking for a job as a copywriter, but looking through these job listings, I said, you know what? That does sound kind of fun, actually. So I went ahead and I just pulled up a few job options that I thought were pretty interesting. Uh, there's some other videos on YouTube that are like, the seven best remote jobs in the world ever, you know, with like rockets and firebombs and stuff. And I watched them and, well, there's thousands of opportunities, if not at least hundreds of opportunities. So to say there's a seven best is kind of crazy, but I want to go over this one, two, three, four, five that I think are, are good and give you a good idea of what the uh, entry level side of, of the market is. So this first one is a social media copywriter at Consumable Content Austin, Texas. They're an agency down there and it says, our ideal candidate is deeply familiar with Austin's food and beverage scene. Quick-witted and culturally aware. I saw, I looked up their, their website. The creative director has tattoos, so you know they're cool. <laughs> um, it says down here, uh, you know, part-time into full-time, 20 hours a week up to 35 bucks an hour. So maybe it doesn't start that high, but certainly if you're making 15, 20 bucks an hour at 20 bucks or 20 hours a week, uh, then you can see the money add up pretty quickly. And a quick side note, I'm not saying everyone out there should apply to be an Austin copywriter. That makes no sense. I'm saying this kind of job exists. And if you are looking for money, Look for jobs like this. Going to a bit more advanced job, this one requires three years of copywriting experience, uh, but certainly if you have your own websites, your own brands, you've been doing it for a lot longer than that. It's at Insomnia Cookies. Even Insomnia Cookies needs remote copywriters. Uh, the job is based in Philadelphia, but you look at any job posting site and they are open to remote workers. Position duties, write stuff about cookies, <laughs> work with brand and communications, developing, crafting, and monitoring the brand's tone of voice from every Oxford comma to every cookie pun. <laughs> 
must have a command of current lexicon, pop culture, and zeitgeist. Convey the warmth and deliciousness of every cookie that we bake in a million bazillion ways. Certainly, they could have used a better copywriter for this ad. I see why they're hiring. Uh, but this one takes three three years of experience. Uh, let's go over to this one. Uh, job copywriter at Aurora. Uh, university degree in English. Two years at a B2B software company. One year in uh, emphasized SEO content. So the thing about this, any copywriting you do is going to be SEO content marketing. If it's not, then you're just literally writing random words for no purpose. SEO stands for search engine optimization. And if you're not doing that, uh, you're probably wasting your time. Oh, and by the way, this company that I just pronounced, Aurora, it's Aurea, they'll pay you $100,000 a year. Now, again, this is one that takes three years experience, but as you're learning, that's easy to accumulate. Speaking of SEO content, the Hoth, is a, an SEO ad agency and they're hiring freelance workers. And uh, as opposed to the other jobs that pay either by the hour or potentially a salary job, this is freelance only. Uh, so they're looking for optimization reports, five bucks per page, uh, 150 words for 750, 300 words for 15 bucks, uh, you know, et cetera, et cetera. I'm not gonna go over all those numbers you can read. Uh, and they pay their writers every Monday with PayPal. Now, I would bet that this is probably for someone who's in a different country, just by the way it looks. A uh, thousand words for 45 bucks. That's about two pages, two and a half pages of writing. Uh, probably is going to take you like four or five hours, bare minimum. So to make 45 bucks on that as a 1099 freelance employee is pretty low, but still you do this for a year or two on the side, you know, whenever you need some extra cash and then you can apply to the higher, uh, higher experience demanding jobs. The last one I wanted to show uh, is an Amazon company. It's buy box experts. And this is a company who hires people to write Amazon listings more or less, at least that's what it looks like. And if not Amazon listings, it's content about optimizing Amazon listings. It has to do with Amazon and Amazon uh, listing content. So if you are someone who does private label stuff and maybe it's not working out for you or it didn't pay off the way you thought it would, you can do this on the side and still run your private label business uh, assuming there's no issue with it. And not only will you learn more about making better Amazon listings, you'll get paid while you do it. It, it really is a win-win process. And like I said, no one is sponsoring me. This would be a great ad. Maybe I should reach out to him and say, hey, you want to do, you want to pay for a video? Uh, but I'm just doing this because I there are so many jobs out there that are not filled and so many people who are financially struggling that I hope that if, if that's you and you feel as if, you can't compete in today's job market for whatever reasons, you throw away those ideas uh, and begin applying, you know, if not as a copywriter, as some kind of remote job. And if you enjoyed this video, if you thought it brought value to your life, please, I encourage you to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and comment below with why or why not you would do this. I'd love to hear your opinions. Again, my name is Blake. I thank you for watching and I'll see you later.